Since then, lots of processes have changed, like pumping the water much lower in the ground. But Southside residents still tell me that they're suffering. Until the late 1980s, groundwater was the only option for Tucsonans. They would pick up their water from wells like this one, one of nine now permanently closed. Because the water inside was being contaminated by Hughes Aircraft, a company that provided lots of Tucsonans with jobs. The lasting impact hit hundreds of Southside residents, leading to a multi-million dollar settlement. I know what this water did to myself and all those people that swam in here every day. We can't change the past, but we can definitely make sure that we don't have those same kinds of problems into the future. Tonight, we investigate how Tucson Water is working to keep your water clean and whether another lawsuit can hold up in court. Sierra Encinas, Kiga 9 on your side.